So today we're going to be learning how to play Dancing with Our Hands Tied Rep Tour version. My cat is scratching at the door one second. While we were dancing, dancing with our hands tied, hands tied, yeah we were dancing. We've got a little someone who is bored out of their mind right now. Do you need something to play with? Let me see if I have something. <gasps> A dead piece of grass. This is literally like a dead piece of grass. I want to keep playing with you, but I do need to film a guitar tutorial. I can play with you when I'm done. Lay down. That cat has absolutely zero chill right now. So in order to play this song exactly like Taylor did on the Reputation Stadium Tour, you're going to need a capo here on the second fret. Now if you're sitting there like, yeah, that's cool, the Rep Tour version, but I really want to play the album track version. It's literally the same thing that we're doing in this tutorial. The only difference is just the key. So all you have to do is just move your capo up one fret and it will sound exactly like the album track. So our first chord is an F major 7 Overseas, it's like making an F major 7, you just have an extra finger here. Um, basically, instead of the shape being like this, you're going to move this one up one string, and then you're going to tuck your pinky where your ring finger would normally be with an F major 7, and you're going to strum from the A string or the 5th string on down. Now, keep this shape because we're actually going to just um, move a couple of things here. So. Take off your last two fingers and then move this finger up one string. This is going to give us an A minor 7. So we're going to go ahead and strum from the 5th string on down. It's really pretty. Now hold this shape again because we're going to go ahead and move our middle finger up one string and then add on our last two fingers here. So it's kind of like making a G major except we still have our index on here and you're going to strum down on all of the strings. And then our last chord of the bunch is a C major. And for this one, you're also going to strum down from the fifth string. So the first thing, chord progressions. Our main progression in this song is F major seven over C to our A minor seven to our G add 11. Now, this changes in the second line of the chorus from the F major 7, instead of going to the A minor 7, we're going to go to a C major. That's only in the second line of the chorus and then it goes to the G at 11. So just remember in that second line, instead of A minor 7, it's C major. That is the only place that it occurs in this song. It is the only different part that you have to remember. Just don't forget that part. So I'm gonna give you guys three different strumming patterns that you can use in this tutorial. We're just gonna start really easy here with a down, 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 down up pattern. Down, 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 down up. One, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, all right, moving on to our more structured patterns here. This is more so what Taylor uses when she plays. So this first one is uh, a down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. Now you'll notice that between the A minor seven and the G out 11, those two chords actually share that one pattern is like split between the two. So first let's just work on nailing down this pattern. So let's go ahead and mute our strings. We have down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. One, two, three, four, and one, and two, three, four, and. Come on, do it with me. Jump in whenever you can, just like hopscotch. Or is it, no, jump rope. That was so much fun in school with jump rope where you would just like have, I don't know, like a fun like rhyme going on and then you just jump in. But it's the same thing. You have to feel the rhythm when you're doing jump rope too. So that first up strum that you hit in that pattern, that is where that transition comes in. So we'll take it really, really slow again. So we have down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. Just like that, 
practice it, take it as slow as you need to, but that is where that transition happens. Now our last and final pattern is pretty much almost the same thing as the pattern we just did, but it starts off just a little bit differently, so it's gonna sound like this. Down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. There's a lot going on with that one. We're gonna break it down. So, meet your strings again. Down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. One and two, three, four, and one and two, three, four, and jump in. One and two, three, four, and. All right, now with the chords in the same transition is going to happen in the same spot. So just remember that the pattern only starts off differently. That's the only difference. Dancing with the hands set, hands set. Yeah, we were dancing. And I had a bad feeling. All right, now before we move on into our playthrough, there is one more thing that we need to talk about that occurs during the chorus just to make sure that we have the icing on the cake or this is not gonna be how Taylor plays it. So how we're gonna do this, I'm first gonna just get really close here because you need to see, y'all need to see what I'm doing. This finger right here. If you watch that rep tour performance, you're gonna see this finger just doing some tricks over here. Doesn't that sound Awesome. So I am using the pattern down, up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. So make your F major seven over C and let's prepare for lift off. In three, two, one. Oh, that works perfect. If you actually count it out, three, two, one, kind of like a rocket ship lifting off, that works. Three, two, one. That was pretty clever of me. I'm not even gonna be modest about that. I'm just gonna take the point for that one. Now that's the structured way to do it. The Taylor way to do it, of course, would be intuitively. And she changes it in so many ways. She puts a little bit of a resting period in and that's the way I like to play it too. It just feels better and it just sounds better. So the pattern changes a little bit. Down, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down, up, down, up. So you come back on another up strum. Down, up, down, 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 up. Just like that. I actually get a little bit of a hammer-on effect when I go back into the strumming. So when I land that finger back on, it turns into a hammer-on. So that's what you want. That's the really cool effect of playing with a little bit of a rest in there. Just tweaking the strumming pattern just a little bit. So that is everything that you're going to need to know to play Dancing with Our Hands Tied. Yeah. 
that is how you play dancing with my hands tied. I hope you guys found my tutorial helpful. I'm gonna leave a link to the rep tour version down below. There's actually somebody uploaded an audio file. So as long as it's there, you can uh, you can practice with it or you can, you know, turn on Netflix. But you know, you have to do a lot of scrolling to find it. But that is gonna be it for today's video. I wanna thank you so much for hanging out with me and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.